Today we'll be going over the top 5 fake celebrities on Twitter. Let's get into the video. Number 5, Michael Bay. Hollywood director Michael Bay is known for his over-the-top action movies, but not so much for being an auteur. From The Rock and Armageddon to Transformers, Bay has carved out a niche as a big money director who's more interested in explosions and character development and plot. His persona as a womanizing party animal has led to a lot of good nature derision over the years, but with large box office grosses, Transformers brought in more than 700 million worldwide, it's doubtful that Bay will be going back to film school anytime soon. The basis for the fake Bay Twitter account is to poke fun at his ego and lack of filmmaking skills. Fans of Bay may be upset, but others are getting quite a kick out of it. On top of that, the lens is wrong. Bay frequently shoots these shots with a telephoto lens, which compresses movement integrated. Movement of the camera, movement of the background, and here. And last, the low angle is there to give us the scale, and slow motion is there to Number 4, Chuck Norris. A funny thing happened in 2005. Martial arts actor Chuck Norris became more popular than he had been since his Walker, Texas Ranger days, thanks to a joke that became an internet phenomenon. Someone thought it would be funny to make up a sheet of Chuck Norris facts that make the actor out to be some kind of superhuman capable of only eating one Lay's potato chip or sneezing with his eyes open. Like most viral phenomenon, there's really no explanation on why it took off. The online community found it funny, and the rest is history. It wasn't long before a fake Twitter account was created so fans of Norris and comedy could all have a laugh on a daily basis. Number 3, Darth Vader. Darth Vader may not be a real person, but that didn't stop someone from creating a fake Twitter account for the Dark Overlord of the Star Wars film franchise. As it turns out, Twitter users are always up for a laugh whether the Twitterer is a real person or not. The Darth Vader account had more than 70,000 followers in April 2009. Creating an account for a fictional character is a good opportunity for fans of the character to breathe some comedic life into their persona. No word yet on what Star Wars creator George Lucas thinks about Vader's sweets. Let's hope he gets the joke and that the account stays active. Darth Vader may not have had much of a sense of humor in the Star Wars movies, but his Twitter updates are chock full of hilarity. Number 2, Stephen Colbert. Comedian Stephen Colbert has made a career in comedy with a subtle sense of humor that can only be described as deadpan. Not only does Colbert rarely crack a smile on his comedy television show, The Colbert Report, but he typically delivers his unique brand of political commentary with a deadly serious stern look on his face. Many people who don't follow the show can't tell if the host is serious or not, but make no mistake, Colbert is always joking. After getting his start as a field reporter on Buddy John Stewart's The Daily Show, Colbert landed his own show in 2005. The show has proved to be popular with viewers and critics alike. In 2008, The Colbert Report won an Emmy Award for Outstanding Writing for a Variety Music or Comedy Program. Number 1, Christopher Walken. Actor Christopher Walken has something not many Hollywood stars can claim, mainstream notoriety and a cult following. In the world of movies, you're typically one or the other. Because of Walken's unusual speaking voice and cadence, he's become an icon that can take a small part in a little-known movie and turn it into a funny and memorable performance. Walken's appearances on the late-night sketch comedy show Saturday Night Live have become the stuff of legend, and his catchphrase from one of those skits, I Need More Cowbell, is now part of the American pop lexicon. Add to this fact that Walken can appear menacing and terrifying with his ghostly looks and imposing frame, and what you get is right for a hysterical phony Twitter account. The problem is, Twitter shut down what had become its most popular fake account, an outcry from fans of Walken and comedy everywhere soon followed. Since then, several new Walken fakes have turned up, but the original remains in shutdown mode. The outcry has made Twitter take notice, but there's no word yet on whether the popular account will be reinstated. That's gonna do it for today's video guys, thank you for watching, if you enjoyed the video leave a like on the video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss out on any of our videos in the future. I'll catch you next time, goodbye.